Hi guys, I'm Anna Jobling and I'm here at Law Freestyle with the Love to Talk. So let's get started. I'll be answering some of your questions. Okay. If you get to cast your very own leading co-star, who would you want to work with? Probably Theo James from Divergent. Malone to Firdaus was a raging success and the second season is nearing its finale. How do you feel right now? Honestly, I'm feeling a little bit sad and nostalgic because after the first season, I thought it was done, but then we got a second season. So now I'm feeling really, really sad because it's almost over and I've made so many new memories and a larger fan base now. And I think I wouldn't be where I am today without Malone to Firdaus the first season. So I'm really sad and I don't think there will be a third season. I mean, you never know. Okay, let's see what else. If there is one moment from the past you would change, what would it be? You know, the cliche answer would be I wouldn't change anything because I wouldn't be who I am today. But I feel like one thing I would probably change is learning to say no more often and to not people please. You know, you don't always have to be nice to someone just because you want them to like you. I feel like you should have boundaries and you should make people respect you as a person. Okay, next up we have... What do you think makes a good actress? Something that would make someone a good actress or an actor would probably be willing to always learn something new and not being afraid to ask for advice or help. If you ever feel like you don't know what you're doing or if you're stuck, you should always ask. Next up. As an actress, what role do you want to try next? Oh my God, I love this question. I feel like there's so many roles I haven't done yet. And I feel like I would love to do something really terrifying like a horror movie or something like a psychotic thriller would be really fun or even action like a really action-packed movie I feel like that would be a really good challenge for me because I feel like that's something I'm really interested and in, been wanting to do for a really long time so hopefully in the future I get the chance and opportunity to do so so if there's any producers out there that want to do an action movie or something you can call me <laughs> I'm scared. These, these make me nervous. <laughs> Who is your ultimate role model in the world of acting? Um, I would probably say Anne Hathaway. I really love her. I think she is such a great actress. You know, she can pull off literally any role. And she does an amazing job as well. So I really love Anne Hathaway. I really look up to her as a role model when it comes to acting. I feel like we're going to go through all of these. And you can pick which one. <laughs> Next up, with social media, negativity and criticism are inevitable. How do you deal with it? I've learned to stop caring. If it's good criticism and if you say it in a way as if you're advising me, then I'll take that into consideration. I try to be careful, but you know, everybody makes mistakes. And just because we are, a public figure and what my job is as an actress is very public. I don't know how to say it. I feel like we're not allowed to make mistakes. It's very hard for us to do, but we're just, you know, we're just normal people and we make mistakes and we learn from them and we grow from them, but it does take time and I'm learning every single day. Focus on you, focus on what makes you happy. <laughs> okay, next up. What's next for Anna Jobling in 2023? What is next for me? Oh my goodness. Um, I feel like I've been on set for the past two years and I haven't stopped. <laughs> so I'm taking a little break for a little while um, just to travel and to focus on my endorsements and campaigns. Just because I'm taking a break from acting does not mean I'm taking a break from work. I'm still working every single day. Um, I feel like that's what makes me the most happy. Okay guys, we're done with all the questions. I hope you guys enjoyed. But if you guys want to know more, go check out my story at lafacellemalaysia.com.